to me, spirit. Hey, what it do, YouTubers? Thank you for your love, share, comment, and support. Once again, if you like my videos, hit the subscribe button and hit the like. It gets it going. Also, leaving comments also get it flowing. I was telling you about the tea, uh, coffee ground, so we're going to do a coffee uh, divination, all right? If you're new to this channel, I do curse. So if cursing offends you, then I'm not the reader for you. This is a judgment-free zone. I will be teaching classes on oils and how to make your own whole oils and herbs to how to tell your herbs what to do, okay? Also, I will be teaching a class on divination. I don't, I like to get a group of people that's going to do it. Also, mentoring. I'm also a mentor. I like to do it in groups. It will be done in a classroom and it's easier, you know, when I'm mentoring groups because I make y'all partner up. But if you don't want a group, I can still do it one on one. All right, let's get into it. All right, this is what it looks like. If you see in the middle, there's a black cat. Also, you can see a face in it. So I'm getting ready to read it, and then I'm going to go on and do cards, all right? All right, someone is connected to bears. So this is someone that has Native American in their bloodline or connected to heavy shaman, all right? Your shaman family, your Native Americans are coming to you. They talking about stand strong, be proud of who you are, walk with confidence, walk with courage. You are not alone. You have many uh, elders with you at this time. Start paying attention to the clouds. They show you things in the clouds. If you see a bunch of crows, that is messages. If you see just a big raven, raven normally are alone or they are in twos. All right, that means pay attention, go into meditation. They're talking to you constantly. Someone needs to go back to school and learn about herbs. You're going to be a herbalist and you're going to be successful at it. And you're going to uh, break down and leave legacies to your children. Spirit is also saying, let me reverse that. Not your blood children, but you're going to have a lot of adopted children, spiritually adopted children that you're going to take under your wings to mentor and teach about herbology. And you're going to leave legacies of those. Also, Spirit says someone has the gift to read smoke. Pay attention to the color smoke of your candle and in, uh, incense. You hear messages. You're very heavily connected to the natives. The natives read smoke. All right. Somebody's ancestor that they know that has passed on was a teacher, a history teacher. They are trying to connect with you. Someone's car is getting ready to break down. I'm hearing the check engine light came on. It's going to be your transmission. Spirit is saying you are going not going to be able to get a fix. You're going to wind up getting another one. So start saving up your money. Someone needs to go before their elders. The elders, they all dressed in white. These are your primordial elders. They really want your attention. A lot of people wait till the eve of Halloween, but Spirit said, no, it cannot wait. You need to go now. You get ready to get an upgrade. You are getting ready to get your right to passage, and you have to go before the council. So you're going to get fruits, vegetables, meat, wine, rum, and you're going to go before them. Your candles have to be white and black, and you're going to go before the elders. Someone is going to go through a financial loss. But this is just temporarily. It's because you're spending crazy. And your ancestors keep telling you what you're spending. So they're going to slow down your money so you can't spend on stuff. They said, look around. Look at your room. Look at your closet. You are like a hoarder. You got things that you don't even use or want. You need to start giving that away. 
Also, that's called the law of reciprocity. Someone seeing a lot of butterflies. Someone be careful if you own a motorcycle. Uh, you are very, you always getting in freak accidents. You're going to, your life will be spared, but you're going to have a near-death experience because someone is going to run a red light and you're going to think you're going to get hit and it's going to make you do a willy on your front tire. But you're going to, your ancestors are going to catch you, but it's going to make uh, your life flies before your uh, face. This is a spiritual death, near-death experience. You need this to go to your next episode. Someone is going to get a applause, a standing ovation. So I don't know if you've seen in some type of opera or you play some type of in a sympathy or something. You're going to get your own solo. You're going to get a standing ovation. People are going to applaud you because you're very angelic. You heal people. Someone is slacking on their garden spirit is saying you need to start getting your garden. Someone has a, a spirit, a house spirit who refuses to leave. You need to feed the house spirit. It's not nothing bad, but you need to acknowledge the house spirits because they do a lot of stuff for you. Someone needs to go outside and just feed the birds, feed the squirrels. God is requesting this from you. had a dog that passed it's around you heavily your dog still protects you sometimes you feel it at the bottom of your feet or you feel like your uh, bed jumps that is your your dog someone is has uh, Caribbean oats real bad your ancestors practice obia obe obeye obeye Obey, I thank you. I'm here in Trinidad, heavy Trinidad. Someone's Lama Damas is feeling neglected. I don't know if you got them in the box or you ignored them. They saying let them out. Someone needs to do shadow work and invite your ancestors in. Someone needs to go visit a plantation. Um, y'all gonna take a tour of the plantation. They want you to see where your ancestors come. This is gonna be a spiritual intervention for you. Someone is trying to move off grid, start your own community. Spirit is saying, if you start preparing for the right people will come and help. If you build it, they will come. Someone has a dark cloud over them. Someone is doing something to you. So you need to cleanse yourself and your house. You need to wash your linen in ammonia on, on, recent, on the rent cycle. Someone's getting ready to get a new vehicle. Someone's seeing snails. Spirit is saying you need to look up the spiritual meaning of a snail. Whoever, there's going to be some type of vol volcano. I'm picking up Hawaii. No, no casualties though. It's going to be a small eruption. Everybody's going to be saved. Someone's just visited Mount Rushmore or get ready to go see Mount Rushmore. Someone has strong roots to uh, Tillman, Elliot Tillman. You have family roots with him. He is definitely around you. I'm hearing the name Helen. The letter H can be significant to someone. Someone's mother's birthday is coming up, or it could be a grandmother you call mother. Um, she wants your attention. Get her a cupcake and wish her a happy earthly, I mean heavenly birthday. Someone's gonna go through a major tower moment. This is not gonna be a good one, but you have the strength. You have to go through this. They cleanse and things that does not resonate towards your higher good. Someone really need to pay attention to the clouds and the birds. 
Someone is heavily connected to the mermaids. The water is calling you. Someone who has a family member that's an exotic dancer or you are an exotic dancer, send them energy and courage right now. Or someone used to be an exotic dancer. Someone is connected to the phoenix. Someone is part of draconian. I'm getting heavy Capricorn placement, sun, moon, rising. Also, I'm getting heavy Taurus, sun, moon, rising. Someone needs to eat more mushrooms and also someone has a lot of mushrooms growing in their yard. Spirit is saying that's a message. Take a picture of it and zoom it in. The letter E can be significant. The letter C. Someone's falling in love with their self. New love is coming. I'm here. I'm seeing several people rejoicing, dancing. So I don't know if y'all going to go to a concert. Be careful. COVID is still around. Someone is getting ready to meet a celebrity. And they're going to say, wow. Someone's supposed to be teaching Zumba or some type of exercise class. People say, you're slacking. Someone's supposed to be writing a cookbook. Someone needs to make some type of uh, mojo with rue and blessed thistle in it. This is a spiritual protection mojo. Rue and blessed thistle. Those are two of the ingredients that I'm seeing. Someone needs to put their crown back on and recognize the person in the mirror. You took your crown off. You need to remember who the fuck you are. Someone needs to eat more carrots, drink carrot juice. Someone needs more beta, beta carotene. You can get that in sweet potatoes too. Also, I'm hearing a peach cobbler or a peach pie, whatever you want to say it. Someone needs to go get their eyes rechecked. It's been a long time. Someone's having dental problems. Someone needs to pay attention to a group of geese flying towards like a letter V. They, they pointing you to a certain direction. Whoever knows this and know what I'm talking about. Someone has an ant problem. They said white chalk could help get rid of the ant problem. And I'm keep hearing victory and success. The letter W, the letter V can be significant. The number five can be significant. Someone's getting ready to move. It's going to be like in a little small cottage. It's, it's for you. It's only meant for you. Someone needs uh, inner child healing. Your solar and sacral is fucked up. You have like you've been molested or raped. You need to heal. You need some type of uh, session, Reiki session that's going to help heal you. Someone's connected to the black swan. Someone's having heart problems, heart palpation because it runs in your family. You need to leave the caffeine alone. Someone is really, really into have heavy Native Americans. They really talking to you. Someone's grandfather or uncle was a pool short, always wore, uh, played pool. Someone was a gangster. Someone was into jazz or blues. Any relative that was into jazz and blues or like B.B. King or Muddy Water. Someone is definitely connected to Mississippi. You need to get in touch with your ancestors that are from Mississippi. Someone's getting ready to leave a situation. Someone is going to Maine. Near the lighthouse, Maine. Visit Maine. 
You getting called to a lighthouse? Someone is getting ready to meet their fairy. Don't be afraid. Someone always wore some type of gangster brim, those gangster hats. <coughs> he dressed to the nine. Looked like he was born in the 1930s or something. I'm hearing Willie, William, could be first or last name. Someone's going to board a flight. You're going to have safe travels. Someone's having problems with their hands. I don't know if you're trying to do boxing or kickboxing. Spirit is saying you have arthritis. You need to take care of that. Someone is taking something out of the oven. I don't know if you're going to start baking something or thinking about baking something. Or your ancestors want you to bake something. I'm hearing chocolate chip cook. Someone's meant to be in a be a chef, culinary. Y'all got mad culinary skills. You need to start getting on that. You're gonna make a lot of money. I see you in a little uh, food truck selling money. If you are anything veteran or something, you can get that for free, hot dog court, whatever you wanna call it. Someone needs to pay attention to their pets. They've been acting funny lately. You under spiritual attack. Someone's mother, Regina is a significant name, is a name, Regina, Rochelle, Rachel, Samuel, Sam, Walter, Ben, Benjamin, Thomas, Dallas, Karen, Angela, and The letter S, the letter R, the letter C, something with a wishbone, someone's supposed to be doing bone readings, someone is are scared of being of their inner calling because they don't want to be labeled as a witch. You are a spiritualist, love, you're not a witch. All right, that is what I'm getting. Let's see what the cards have to say from the ancestors. I already pre-shuffled them. What messages do you have for them? Show me clearly. Talk to me, spirit. I'm hearing 8-8, eight, eight, the lion's portal, going to be significant to someone. Just heard DNA upgrade. Someone's supposed to be teaching preschool. Preschool teacher. Someone is getting ready to hit it quick. Rich, you're going to get the lottery, which is enough for you to get pampered. I see you getting a spa in a hotel. Um, you be giving by yourself flowers. you paying off your debt. I'm hearing scratch off. That's what I'm hearing. Someone is refusing to... Be seen with their talents because they care what their family think. I keep telling y'all that it's not your family. you only there to help heal. Someone needs to understand because when you was uh, pregnant in your mother's womb, you have a lot of ancestral trauma. You have the trauma your mother went through, your grandmother, your great-grandmother, all the way from all the mothers on their side is flowing in you. You really need to heal that. Someone needs to sit back and relax and read a good book. And sip on a dry martini. What else, spirit? Someone that likes fishing, you need to go out there. That's therapy, I'm hearing. A lot of y'all things are ending for y'all, and that's a good thing. Love is coming into you. You're starting to love on your ancestors more. But some of y'all still stuck. Y'all don't know which way because y'all still care what people think. Y'all still stuck in that religious uh, mind frame. And it's like you're not paying attention to your ancestors. I hope you know your ancestors come before the Lawas and the Orishas. And for some reason, y'all refuse to do that. And y'all got it all fucked up. Your ancestors is what gave you access to the Orishas 
in the Loire. Yup, your ancestors are being denied. Y'all ignoring your ancestors. Y'all feel like y'all don't need to, but uh, sorry for y'all. Y'all do. Collaboration with somebody. Someone has strong divination skills. Someone needs to have Parmigiana around them that's asking for your attention. Someone needs to make mojos, a money mojo bag and a protection mojo bag. Some people call it gri gri bags you're supposed to be doing. Somebody's supposed to be making something with alligator feet, swamp water or something with alligator feet. Someone needs to hurry up and make your, your pendants. Um, you're supposed to be making pendants and they can use it as a pendulum. Someone thinking about getting their nose pierced. Spirit said, go ahead and do it. Spirit also said someone's getting lied on because they see you progressing. So they're trying to turn as many as people uh, from you and lie on you saying you did this and do this. Y'all in trouble because you pissing that person's ancestors off and it's getting ready to get sent back to you. Someone's dreaming about being near the water. You're getting ready to start meeting your ancestors near the water. I think this is those uh, Trinidad ancestors that I was talking about in the cup. Confirmation. They practice obia. Money is around a lot of y'all. Someone's manifesting money. Spirit is saying uh, you need to do an oil lamp. The ancestors did an oil lamp. That's going to help you get money also. Oil lamp. What is an oil lamp? This is an oil lamp. Our ancestors used the oil lamp. anything else for them someone's gonna start dating you get ready your boo things get ready to come you get ready to move into with them or y'all gonna plan on moving in with you with each other he's gonna move in with you or you're gonna move into him um y'all gonna have a pre-made marriage pre-made marriage We're already made family your llama damas is putting this together Somebody has a blue Lama Dama, one has a red, and they waiting for you. They happy. They said, finally. But you still got to be you. Quit trying to do things to make this person happy. You're uniquely different. Someone's business is getting ready to start off. Someone needs to get their LLC. Whatever somebody's manifesting, you're getting ready to get it. Because things are ending for you in new beginnings. Let's get the charms. Okay, Spirit said these charms. I never look at them, I just pick. Someone's about to turn over a new leaf. Someone is definitely connected to aliens. Also, the water is definitely calling to somebody. Someone needs to really start doing their uh, needle natal chart. You're very good at astrology, astronomy. That is one of your callings. Someone is getting ready to find love. Like I said, someone's watching you. They got the Cupid arrow pointing to your heart. You're going to fall for this person hard. Everything happens in divine timing. Uh, someone keep waking up at exactly 4 o'clock in the morning. They're trying to tell you they want to talk. Someone is thinking about unicorns or seeing unicorns. When you meditate, you going into that realm. Loving you, loving yourself. Someone needs to connect to their wolf, uh, their wolf. Someone needs to connect to the Apache Indians. You have one of some of your ancient ancestors or Apache. Someone is loves Hello Kitty. So if you have a Hello Kitty. Or someone like this, something in this reading has a message for you. Someone needs to eat more avocados if you're trying to get pregnant. If this doesn't resonate with you, don't force it. You know, book a private reading with me. Uh, like, share, comment. Tell me how you think about this uh, coffee grind reading. I'm going to try to do all the divinations for y'all so you'll know what to expect in the class. Once again, like, share, subscribe, comment. Get me up to 400. I will be blessing someone. 
What a gift. All right. Peace, love, and light. Asheo.